Rosie was in the spotlight when she attended St. Lawrence Paris Fashion Week after refusing a request from one of the reporters. Rosie appeared with sunglasses at Paris Fashion Week. St. Laurent was highlighted because of her attitude in refusing one of the reporter's requests. Rosie's attitude in refusing the reporter's request made her a topic of conversation among netizens after attending St. Laurent's Paris Fashion Week. When Rosie appeared on the red carpet at Paris Fashion Week, one of the reporters asked her to take off the sunglasses she was wearing. Rosie together with Saint Laurent attended Paris Fashion Week with an elegant appearance wearing sunglasses. Appearing different from usual made the reporter ask Rosie to take off the sunglasses she was wearing for a moment. But it turns out she refused with an adorable expression and of course caught everyone's attention, including netizens. Rosie refused gracefully and charmingly when the sunglasses that complemented her outfit were removed at the request of journalists. The Blackpink member's personality is also interesting and considered unique because he is able to maintain her elegant appearance without having to fulfill the requests of people around her. Rosie also received lots of complimentary comments from netizens, her act of refusing actually looked cute and her expression was adorable. Meanwhile Jenny is currently not only busy with her schedule as an idol, but also her new duties as CEO of the agency she built herself, namely Auditlier. In the latest vlog uploaded to the YouTube channel on Wednesday, Jenny exposed her activities for a full day. Jenny seemed to be recording herself in the car. Jenny revealed that she had just finished filming for the show, Apartment 404. Jenny admitted that her activities that day had started at 6 o'clock in the morning and only finished filming at 1600 hours in the afternoon. Even though her body was feeling tired, Jenny couldn't go straight home to rest. She had to continue going to the agency office to pursue her other work. To rest her tired body for a moment, Jenny chose to sleep in the car during the one-hour journey to her residence. Not long after that, Jenny seemed to be back to her activities. Exactly at 1800 hours in the afternoon she arrived at the office. Unlike company bosses who keep their distance from their employees, Jenny actually looks very warm and like family with the people in the office. Even though her face looks tired, Jenny still shows her professionalism as a leader in her office. Jenny seemed to be involved in small talk with her colleagues. Not infrequently they share laughter when they are talking about something funny. Jenny said, while we were sharing our work with each other, discussing future plans and exchanging opinions, two hours passed. This idol born in 1996 shows a dignified attitude that truly reflects a leader. Jenny and her colleagues immediately continued their activities by watching the first episode of the program, Apartment 404, as she mentioned at the beginning.